Hello everyone, my name is Wouter de Maal and I'm a ServiceNow Master Architect working at Fruition Partners. And today I'm highlighting the use of predictive intelligence to automatically populate the business service field on the incident during the creation of the ticket. And we're doing that based on the existing incidents that are currently on the ServiceNow instance. By doing that, we are improving the user experience for the end users, but also for the agents, as we were doing that in the agent workspace, but also in the service portal. We are reducing the reassignments because based on the history, we know what the assignment group should be and what the service should be. And that will also help us in a faster mean time to resolve. So let's have a look at the ServiceNow instance at the solution definition within the predictive intelligence application. As you can see, our solution definition says that we are going to predict the surface field on the incident table. And we're doing that with the input fields of short description and description, which means we will have to ask them during the ticket creation. We need these two fields. But then we are predicting that based on the existing incidents in the incident table where the uh, filter is applied, active is false, and creation on the last six months. Which means we will get an accurate uh, list of incidents that will really help us in predicting the right surface. So let's have a look at the ServiceNow instance in the agent workspace, where I'm going to create a new ticket. In this case, it's a call, which is a type of task. And we're first filling in the caller and business user. That's the first thing that the agent has to do. And then providing a short description of, of the incident. We also provide the description and based on these two fields, we can then fill in the business service offering. But already based on the description on the right side, you will see the agent assist providing suggested knowledge articles. If we leave the description field, uh, removing the focus from there, and uh, you will see that the business service offering will be filled in. It's set to Office 365 and on top you will also see the confidence level and a confirmation to the user that the business service is set. And that will also provide the assignment group directly. And that is how we are helping the agents because they don't have to select it themselves but we are doing that based on the 45,000 incidents that are already in the instance. We have the same thing for the service portal to help the agents. We're asking the short description and the description of their incident, which will then fill in the business service. So let's fill in the description. And as soon as we remove the focus from that field, you will again see that we are selecting the Office 365 business service, which if they submit that incident, it will go directly to the right assignment group. And on top, you will also see that confirmation message that it's done uh, with the right confidence level. So that's how we use predictive intelligence to help the users and the agents. And with this solution definition, you will also be ready to uh, quickly use predictive intelligence and see the value of it.